OK, let's go and take a look at some of the stories from around the UK. And it could, hey, a tough day. Could be a mm. tough day for the boss of Tesco, Dave Lewis. It's the company's big investor meeting day, the AGM. And he could be in for some well, a bit of a fl bit of flack, really. Yeah, he Just could be. Now, uh, shareholders will want to know what the master plan is to stem the tide of shoppers and sales going the wrong way. Let's speak now to the retail expert, Phil Durrell. He's live in Salford for us. Uh, Phil, what are we expecting to hear? We heard today that, uh, that sales have slowed somewhat, but uh, a little bit better than they have been in the past. Yeah, they've been on a downward trend for uh, a couple of three years now. But uh, their last uh, results, i.e. this morning, what they published this morning, was a, a declination of 1.3%. So actually, although they, they are still losing sales, the sales, sales decline is slightly moving upwards. So who knows, in 18 months' time, they might actually be growing sales. Um, Phil, can I just quickly get this in? Because uh, on, on um, World News, we often talk about the the international operations of Tesco. Yeah. And there it's kind of been hit and miss. Very important, though, for the company. Um, I'm just wondering, we're starting to now hear some of the murmurings in Asia and the South Korea operations. I mean, that's a big operation uh, part is of a, Tesco, isn't it's it? A, it's a big operation, and it's also a profitable operation for, uh, for Tesco. Unfortunately, uh, Tesco South Korea and Dunhunby, the, um, the marketing uh, angle for um, Tesco, are likely to have a price tag attached to them, simply because Tesco need to find some money somewhere, probably about five billion pounds, to really make sure that its credit rating is improved from the 6.4 billion pound loss they declared in April. So they've got to do something. And South Korea looks like it's got a price tag on it. Uh, Phil, we're gonna have to leave it there, but uh, it's gonna be a really interesting day today pay very much under yeah, under the spotlight today his pay his pay absolutely dave lewis he is in line for a bonus of 525 percent of his salary and there are investor groups out there who are calling uh, for shareholders to reject that pay proposal 501 525 percent wouldn't that huh? be lovely if we 520 got something <laughs> So Richard Branson, we can't show him yet. He's sitting here. He's chuckling. He doesn't even get that. <laughs> no, That's no. just not fair, is it? No. Okay. I know. Tesco, you'd like to be a fly in the wall. I'm sure, we've got some, I'm sure we've got some people there covering that. We'll bring you all the news on that when we get it. We certainly will.